Next Salty. time I'll rip your fucking legs off and shove them up your ass till you've toes for teeth. Ah, oh, Zoltan. Gear up in the nick of time, as always. Zoltan, with your boot to someone's ass, as always. Who were those men? Local color. <laughs> Wasn't they gone more than a moment? Long enough for them to turn our home into theirs. All right, time for some spring cleaning. I've got to boot them all out. Care to join me? With pleasure. <laughs> so no killing? Oh. Yeah, almost like we never left the Oh, that one. Oh, that one's easy. I'm pleased. That went well. Now we can greet each other like the gods of the ages, pal. Hey, Sultan. You look good. Training plenty lately. What with the war on, no Mahakaman meat to be found, but Redanian laggers standing in just fine. You, though, you've weathered a bit. Something worrying you. Got some problems. Rather not burden you. Fuck off, Gareth. <laughs> Need to spill your guts to me now. <laughs> I I I love Zoltan. I really do. Uh, you definitely you don't get to see enough of him. Same with Dandelion. But especially Zoltan right now. I'm really liking him. There's a few things. Let me guess. Triss, Yennefer, by chance? Triss and I talked. Cleared some things up. As for Yennefer, well... So you found her! Ha! Need to tell me all about it. I will. Some other time. Got something a tinge more important to take care of now. Meaning? I'm looking for Ciri. I know she came to Novigrad. Might still be here. You mean she's come back? I'll be damned. I wonder if I'd recognize her. How many years is it now? Six? Seven? But what'd she be doing here? Hiding, probably. She might be in danger. See her in your dreams? Couple times. Her and the Wild Hunt. Oh. Not good. Not at all. But I know she came here and contacted Dandelion. <sighs> we have a wee problem, then. He's got... been Where's taken. Dandelion? <laughs> I'd like to know that myself. Maybe he could explain what the hell's going on. I just barely returned as you saw. Expecting to come home to your hot like a boar in some cold ale. What do you find instead? A shite storm. Dandelion gone, the tavern chocked full of bombs. Have no clue what happened. Hmm. Let's look around. Might find something that'll put us on his trail. Prime idea. I say we start on the ground floor. It's where he sat and wrote. Letter from Fran. Uh, when will you return to Darius? Uh, mm. I hope it will be soon, for I miss you terribly. Waiting to see you again literally pains me. If you if you are to come, send me a message beforehand. Ask my mistress for a day off. Not sure if that's Dandelion's true name or what. Aha! I wrote from a grateful muse. Reading someone else's letters. My visage red and hot. I plunged into purest ecstasy, imbibing its nectar. Your dexterous digits on my soul's yearning cords. <laughs> oh, oh, I love you, Sultan. I truly love you. Whoever did that reading, well fucking done. It is beautiful. Letter from female admirer. The trust of your hypnotic gaze left my visage red and hot. The whole world suddenly set to spinning in a whirlwind of oblivion, and I plunged into purest ecstasy, imbibing its nectar, the music, the singing, you. For that one brief moment I felt as if I were to loot you so skillfully strumming, I wanted nothing more for you to put your dexterous digits on my soul's yearning chords. Seems like the lot of them seem to, you know, copy and repeat. Uh, copy and paste. Drawled. 
<laughs> God fucking damn it. Mm. Nose is too small. Hi, <laughs> and the sword's too big. By the by, is that how it's done? Killing the wyvern. <laughs> Technique's not quite right, but you gotta admit he's doing it with gusto. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and it's the stash here. Fantastic. I'll sell that at some stage. From the finest vineyards, every last one. Who one knows the fruit of the fruit of the vine like dandelion? That's true. The faculty of Oxenford University is honored to grant Julian Alfred Pankratz, Viscount de Letinove, the title of Master of the Seven Liberal Arts. Keep forgetting he's got that damn fool name. The faculty of Oxenford Julian University Al is honored to grant Julian Alfred Pankratz, Viscount de Letinove, the title of Master of the Seven Liberal Arts. Keep forgetting he's got that damn fool name. Yeah, it's not quite a dandelion, is it? Hmm. Dear Viscount, once more I would like to convey my thanks for agreeing to grace my son's wedding ceremony with your song. Presents warmed our hearts, and the sweet notes which you serenaded with us so touched my wife's mother, the uh, Baroness Duvet, called in some circles a cold and heartless bitch, that tears of tender emotion appeared in her eyes. Bo Bo Mill de Rap. <gasps> oh. oh shit. This the loot he got from the elves of Dolbathana. Aye. Must have been in a great rush to leave it behind. Um, remember I was saying before Dolbathana? Uh, that's how they say it. In, it's about the same way, and that's how it's said here, uh, like where I am. But the thing, one bitch of a thing with Irish is, uh, you know when you go to England, cake is cake. It's said, pronounced cake. Go to America, it's pronounced cake. I know there's the diff bickering over the cookies and biscuits thing. Uh, cookies, you know, have chocolate chips or a fuck even raisin in it. If you get a fucking digestive biscuit, it's not a fucking cookie. You know, the Americans are being fucking wrong. But when Ir with Ireland, you go from like, fuck, probably a town to town thing. It's not that quite extreme, but the different provinces, different areas have their own ways of saying, and I want to say, dare even say, spell different words. I know they say things in fucking different ways. So, you like, you go from, you know, Waterford to, like, Con Mel. Well, maybe not Con Mel, but let's go further afield, let's say Tipperary. Maybe Con Mel is in Tipperary. I have no fucking idea. I shag is my strong point. Um... You know, they have their own different way of saying it. I remember we had to, learn, for our uh, junior surf, we had to be able to ID the different uh, vernacular. Uh, well, like, to, like, they would read the thing out and we would have to ID it. Because um, we would have an oral exam. And they had just such bot, you know, like, such, well, not. Like, like, we would have a tape we would listen to. And they would say something like, you know, it, something, something, blah, blah. And you wouldn't hear Dobladna. You'd hear something completely different. But it was apparently the same fucking word. It's it's really fucking batty. Plus it didn't really help that they had a really diff difficult accent. Remember I went up to Kilkenny once? A bit on the outskirts. And um, some way off the motor motorway. And I went in, uh, ended up going to the gas station on one stage to get more, you know, gas for the car. Shocks. Um... And I had the great difficulty understanding the person at the uh, register. I was able to muddle it through, but then they were speaking English. Didn't help the f fucking take accents. But, um, yeah, he makes take accents with Irish, and the Irish words being vastly different depending on where you are, it's not a good mix. But yeah, Irish, maybe, but Botana? Maybe that's actually a word in another bit of Dolbatana. It's actually an Irish phrase in, in elsewhere, you know? 
it maybe it's just where I am, dwarf region. It's, it just sounds off. You know? So. Bloody hell if I know is what I'm saying. There's. Basically, Irish is different depending on where you go. It's not like cake and whatnot. Where there's a more universal thing. You know, like saying. Different regions have their own different way of saying Irish. Uh, like, you know. They, they'll take a Irish word in Waterford. It'll be a di very different word in you know, uh, Wicklow, Mayo, they'll have their own different words for it. So, yeah, maybe Blatana is actually a valid pronunci pronunciation in a different, you know, wing of it. Certainly not common around, n not one around here. Cow does, force a habit. Okay, may as well grab this then. Hmm. Ten barrels of Tucson dry, five cases of sodden triple mead. Hmm. Nothing here. No, 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 no! That's exactly what we're looking for. It says planner. Huh. Dandelion and planning. Good one. Besides, anything he wrote here probably had a special system. Chaos only he could ever decipher. Actually, in the past, sometimes not even that. Give him a chance. Might not be that bad. Seems when he inherited this fine establishment, it came with some fine responsibilities. Bookkeeping among them. He also made a habit of noting down the times of his meetings, official and private. So. Who'd he been seeing of late? Ah, here it is. Hmm. Seems he's only been meeting women of late. The dog. Hmm. Not a bad idea. Dandelion's pretty loose-lipped. Might have blabbed something to a lady friend that'll put us on his trail. That's what I'm counting on. Hmm. We should divide these somehow. Perhaps... Ah, fuck it. I'll ask the lassies in my half you interrogate the ones in yours. Should you? Zoltan, wait. This is in verse. And you figure that's unnatural because... Wonderful. Meet me back here when you're done. Share our findings. Right you up. Need to do a wee bit of tidying for a go. I cannot stomach the idea of coming back to this mess. And you'd be wise to read your bit before you scurry off. If you need anything, I'll be next door. Make this platter. Rose Voltaire, like a rose abashed of its crimson hue, fair Rosa would sink into humor's blue. She shunned her lessons in civility to swing her dwarf with, her agil with agility. One sec. Uh, Molly, though she well knows the touch of silk and lace, she shuns not straw when gripped in lust's embrace. Gildolf, uh, uh, villa next to the morgue. Also, charming in garden clothes in Gildolf. Uh, Vespua, though timid in looks, though venture did skip her. Uh, my heart melts when she asks, Ever had a big dipper? Uh, well, since I'm hungry, I'm choosing to believe that's actually food. Uh, far corners, uh, far corners, the uh, laundry near the mouth of the Pontar. Marabella, though her cries are divine when behind closed doors, standing on stage, her squawks are drowned by snores. And the bits near Pauper Square. Uh, El uh, Elha? Elha? A figure both, uh, most rare, her nature jewel, look deep in her eyes, or be made a fool. A tailor shop crossed from the tannery. Oh, have a let. God damn, small fucking world. 
met them in the uh, first game. Second game, sorry. Surprised they didn't. Well, they had set up in here, but I guess he already chased the ones up here out. I'm gonna poach this place, you know, right. Don't need a proper way to greet our friend. Even if he ain't here. All the better if he ain't here for it, I suppose. Pfft. Fucking candles everywhere. Cards, cards everywhere, and not to drop the steel. Like they set up in storerooms. They're probably meant to be bedrooms, but, uh. Yeah. Oh, out of curiosity. Come on. Beautiful. And what's up here? Not but a little cranny, it seems. Guess uh, you would have a table here and could look out the window or read or what have you. Back a bit further than I anticipated to grab that. But, grab it, I did. And there isn't really much up here. It's locked. Damn it. But it kind of looks like a thing exploded on that line. This place doesn't look exploded. In a sense, it looks like a bomb went off in here, but it's a much more metaphorical bomb. It looked like he was camped out there, and the explosion came from over there. And yet, the wall looks just fine. Maybe it wasn't uh, coming through the wall, maybe it was a teleport. Must like the <laughs> Those guys finally, uh started limping off. The gate is named in honor of Novgrad's own son, the, har uh, uh, the Hierarch of the Eternal Fire. Supposedly this name was given to it upon proper request. No one can be found who remembers requesting any such thing. Oh, then not uh, something else on that sign there. I do, uh, I do like that. I do like that. Just, you know, I'm a merely a citizen short in a permanent dwelling. That, that is a funny little way of saying it. Okay, looks like I've got enough slice and dice here a bit. With every last copper. With interest. Give me a week, please. Horson's no banker. He's an honest man. You pay on time, you get protection. You don't pay. Help! What you hollering for, stupid wench? What are you hoping for? A knight in shining armor? Close enough. There's a bit Keep of shine. Not your concern. 